Hello, hi, good morning. My name is Aline Francois, and I'm representing Farm ICN at this morning. And basically, we were one of the agencies at the forefront going from neighborhood to neighborhood, community to neighbor communities. And we, what we found was, you know, a lot of the people did not have basic needs such as water, their medication. We had, you know, people that were diabetic, you know, being handed um, honey buns. So we know right, right there already, not only was the community not served properly, the, res the, the proper resources were not provided. But, you know, the resources that were provided were not adequate or were not even, um, you know, um, basically clear as to, you know, being able to, 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 um, to, to meet the needs of, of the people because they were not able to consume. Um, FUM had long lines days, days and weeks on after the hurricane. We had long lines, you know, over a hundred of people per day or so, you know, coming, asking for water, asking for ice, you know, still not being able to access, you know, their food stamps or not understanding, you know, whether they were qualified. And, you know, with this partnership, I think it, it's great because the resources, being able to get information firsthand in our in our language, in our Creole language, was an issue. And I hope that, you know, by the next time around that we are able to get the information, the people are able to understand the media, what's going on, has they tried to prepare, has our communities tried to help the people prepare. And again, I think this is a great collaboration, and we thank you for the opportunity.